What's happening, everyone? It's TV, and we're back in Petsum 99 to talk about infinite diamonds, or at least close to infinite. It's a lot of diamonds. So stay tuned for that. It's going to be pretty crazy. You're going to see how much money you can make off this method. And no, it's not pay to win. It is entirely free to play to do. So don't worry. It's also mobile friendly. You don't have to like AFK for infinite hours. You don't have to do anything really, really hard. It's pretty easy. And so stay tuned for that. Also, I uh, just want to give you a quick update on my hardcore series. I know a lot of you have been bugging me. TV win hardcore. I mean, yeah, it's been like, has it been a month yet? I feel like it's been a month already has it oh man the thing about my hardcore account okay it got deleted no i'm just kidding it didn't it didn't, it didn't. but uh i i kind of wish i didn't have to do that series anymore because that account is super rich right now i could probably well i can't buy a huge off that account right now but i could probably buy like one of the new you know valentine eggs but just stay tuned for that video i'm just working on getting a huge on that one it's taken a lot longer than i thought i would but uh, you're gonna be surprised by my progress on that account it's pretty crazy been playing on it and i uh, just don't really want to give you like a two minute video for that i mean there's not a whole lot of content i could do on it so anyway also i have some more trading videos coming up so stay tuned for that i hope you like those because they're fun to do i love trading in this game it reminds me of islands so much um also we're in the clan battle still let me show you quick update on how we're looking so you remember i think i was like what number 90 yesterday and we're 35 right now and we're still climbing we're only 63 members some of them should still be zeroed out like i'm 59 now it's crazy um uh, let's see i think we have like one person yeah so super moms is still zero she just joined uh we got this uh tommy nice to meet you just joined so we got some zeros in here still as soon as those pop in their 50s are gonna pop in we're gonna move up even more if you look at it everyone above us has uh more members than us that's all i'm gonna say they have a lot more members than us we're filling up nicely we still have lots of slots available and yeah we're still recruiting we're starting to get a little picky on who we bring in um i do have my alt here where is it right there it's only got 37 achievements so we'll probably replace that with someone real so 13 more slots available so if you want to join my clan there might be a chance discord.gg slash dv plays make sure you have lots of lots of achievements pretty soon we're gonna have to bump up the 50 achievements um thing to probably closer to 55 to 60 so every battle is different so we have to kind of restructure the clan each time but um as far as grinding achievements stay tuned for a video on that i will give you some tips on how to complete these a lot quicker um let me just say this is a really really hard grind you know like i said i only have 59 of 80 right now i've got 21 to go that's a lot of achievements to you know still complete and some of these are just really really hard but i do have some of these pinned uh especially macro so stay tuned for a really fun macro video if you want to see a macro video make sure you hit that like button subscribe if you haven't already but yeah let's get into it so first up let's talk about the diamonds i know it took a little while to get to that just had a lot of updates that i've been holding and i wanted to give you them so what we're going to do is we're going to go through um there's three ways you can do infinite diamonds currently in the game right now with this clan battle kind of messing everything up you know eh, one of the items that we're going to talk about is kind of broken right now because the demand is messed up everyone's trying to complete this which is the magic achievement system right here i got the magic the problem with this is because everyone's buying these magic shards instead of grinding for them they are too expensive now so you can't really make a lot off this one this was going to be included in the video i'll still talk about i'll still show you what i'm talking about but right now because the you know price is inflated as a result because everyone's trying to complete this achievement yeah it's it's not going to work out so much for this video but after the battle is over and people kind of lay off on buying all those shards the shard price will plummet it's probably going to be maybe worth a tenth of what it is now kind of just have to be patient with it but uh we're going to talk about that one first in fact so let me show you the first one and then we're going to get into the second and third one but over over here if you go to the uh haunted mansion and i already did this earlier by the way i made an epic epic profit i think i sold like close to 30 million off of this and it cost me like 24 million and what i did is i went in here to make a charm stone it only requires five of these or five of the buckets so Ultimately, the cost of these used to be only like 8,000. Now they're like 30,000, okay? So they're like three times the price that it should be. You know, even then it's, it's probably even more, it's probably more like four times the price it should be. So eventually this is gonna drop back down. It might work for you still at that point because this right here, this potion, this is actually a huge potion. So it temporarily increases your active huge luck by 300% and you only need 16 of these. And um, so if you think about it, let's just say these are worth 5,000 each. They're not right now, okay? They're worth 30,000 each right now. By the 
time you watch this video, it could be 50,000. I don't know. I don't know how high it's going to go. A lot of people are buying these up because they don't want to grind for them, but they're trying to complete their achievements. And if you look at the price for these, you can sell them. The REP rate now is 209,000. Now the demand for these will never really go down. Charm demand has gone down. These are never going to really go down because everyone's still trying to hatch active huges. Like that's something everyone does. They're going to stack these all day because they need to try to hatch a huge, especially during weekends. These are going to fly up on REP. So that's why it's maintaining a pretty good value. Um, this one right here, this enchant, it's going to pretty stay pretty low. I mean, for 50, look at that. It's a good, good enchant. Don't get me wrong, but this one is the best out of this magic machine. Now, like I said, right now, it's not worth it. Let me show you the REP currently for these guys. All right. So the magic shard, despite it saying 14,000, let's just go try to find one to buy. Actually, this is a pretty good price. This one's going for a little bit more. It's going for like 20,000 each. Like I said, most of the time you're going to see them for a lot more. You know, we might just buy that because it's a good price. We're not going to make our money back on that, but we're just going to hold on to it just in case I need them. Kind of expensive, like right? 20,000 a piece. And what you really need these things to be at is about, I would say 12,000 a piece or less for you to be able to make a profit. Um, that's like the break even actually. So you kind of want to have it about 10,000 a piece at most because 10,000 times 16, again, 160,000 is your cost. And then you go to sell it for 200,000 and you can make 40,000 a piece. Hopefully you're following along with this math. If not, let me show you again. Here's the potion right here. It's worth 200,000. We'll just say that. It, it's worth more, but let's just say that. You could probably sell it for 220. If I'm going to buy 16 of those shards for 11,000, it's going to cost me 176. And then say I sell for uh, 220. Uh, this is my profit off of every single one I make. So I'll make 44,000 off of each potion. So this one's not worth it right now because of the event. And once it goes down to like 5,000 per shard, it's going to be like really, really good money. So just wait for, you know, some time, give it some time and that'll be a really good cash cow. Next one we're going to cover is crystal key. Now this one's not going to be news for some of you, but if you look, crystal keys are going for about 24,000 plus. So you could probably, you know, squeeze it up to like 25 K per key. Keep it at 24,000 for simplicity though. And then you look at these two pieces, right? This is 16,000. This right here is, let's just round it up to three. 3,000. That totals to only 19,000. So you're pretty much, if you just buy these two, if I just click this and say, yes, I just made 5,000. So that's 5,000. That's 5,000. All I got to do, I could probably macro this if I, if I really wanted to. So what you could do is say, I buy a hundred of these, that's 500,000. Say I buy a thousand of these, now we're making five mil. If I wanted to buy a thousand of these uppers, they're costing 16,000 RAP, right? If I wanted a thousand of those, it's gonna cost me 16 million. And then if I wanted to buy a thousand of these, obviously it's gonna cost me 2.6 million. Let's just say it's going to cost me 3 million, all right? So 19 million. That's my cost, right? For a thousand of these. But if I sold a thousand of these keys, for say 25K, I've made 6 million. All I had to do is invest in these for 19 million and I make 6 million. Like who wouldn't do that? That's that's like a no brainer. So we could try that, but I'm gonna show you something that's even more powerful than this. A lot of people prefer the crystal keys over the secret keys though. Like you can make a lot more profit off the secret keys. We'll cover that in a second. Um, they are harder to sell. I think the RIP is kind of going down a little bit. Mainly I think because it's just not as accessible. Like, you know, it's kind of a pain. You, get, you keep getting kicked out. You can't just go and spam open. So so it's a lot slower. Plus, you know, your your average return on a key may be 50 to 80,000 most of the time. Unless you get lucky, then you might get a, a good charm or something. The crystal keys, I don't know why people think these are better, but they do. And I think it's just the simplicity of opening a bunch of them. But these right here, um, you know, literally, let's just do the math real quick, real simple. We'll just round this down to 100,000. Say you buy the uh, uppers for 65, 65 plus 15, you're at like 80,000. And then you're making 20,000 off of each key. If we did 100 of them, we're making two mil. If we're making a thousand of them, we're making 20 million. Now, 100 is obviously going to be a really, really big investment. Now, we're moving into like the 100 million kind of investment stuff because obviously, like this right here, say you spent 65, that's 65 million, right? So you're pretty much having to spend up to 80 mil for a thousand of them. And then you got to still sell them. But 20 million is nothing that, like, that's that's my zone. This is the area I want to be. I don't want to be making 2 million, 3 million, 5 million, 6 million. I want to make 20 million on a thousand of them instead of 6 million. So, but we're going to do a combination of both. I think that's the right thing to do. So what you should be doing is looking for both of these, buy them up, sell the completed keys. Um, it does take a little while to like assemble these. You know, I've only got a handful right now, but look, I mean, I already have 2.5 million technically worth of these. So let's go and uh, shop for some keys. Yeah, let's let's see what we get. All right, here we go. Here's some, uh, it's pretty close. It's pretty close to REP. It's kind of what I imagined. So these are all lowers, of course. 
Oh, that's under our AP right here. By the way, when you're searching, make sure you're searching up the uppers only. Like lowers, you're just gonna find those naturally. They're they're everywhere. No one likes the lowers. All you gotta do is look for uppers, you'll find the lowers. So these are going for just 5,000 more. We can handle it. Just know what you're able to spend on it. But yeah, we can handle that. 14K each. Uh, We can find cheaper. Good deal right now. This is under RAP. Talon, you can find them. Also under RAP, just at RAP. So we'll take those under RAP. What about these 200. Wow, everything's cheap here. So again, patience is everything on these servers. You got it. You just kind of look for the right deals. Make your profits. Hundreds. Look at this. Chest mimic's gone up so much. Didn't I tell you to go buy these? Yeah, everyone's buying them, man. Make your money. It's a good deal. Got 10 of those for only like 20,000. Yeah, we'll do that. These are under our AP by a lot. So let's go and buy these up. Someone just wants to get rid of their keys. These are slightly under our AP. Looks like 95,000 each. Uh, let's grab those. Slightly under. Again, key demand is pretty low. Unfortunately, it is much lower than it used to be. So you're going to be sitting around with a lot of keys, but it is a great way for you to get money. Some people just go through and they just buy them up. It was a lot easier before when the game first came out, but you can still get it. You just have to be really patient. You're going to have to overnight it probably. Anyway, we spent a lot. We spent 80 million on all these things. Let's see. Uh, let's go and make all these keys. I won't bore you with clicking on them all. All right, so let's see how many we got. We got 1,400 keys and 500 secret keys. We should be able to make some really good profits off these. We also have a bunch of lower halves here for later materials. But uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to move these over to my alt. I'm going to have it AFK and sell all these, make me some good money. And uh, we're going to do it again. Anyway, I hope this was helpful to you. If it was, please hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Also, I have a macro video coming up. So if you're curious how to streamline all these achievements, I'm not going to show you some secret ones. Obviously, my clan is competing. You know, we want to stay in the top 50. I don't want to show everyone our secret sauce. Uh, I will show you how to do the big chest. I'm going to show you how to do comments. I'm going to show you how to do some of these. They're going to be pretty easy to automate. Same with the jars. Flags are real easy. So yeah, I'll give you some tips on completing a bunch of these. I will show you all of them, obviously, because I got to keep some secrets. My clan's going to get mad at me if I show everything. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I will see you all in the next vid. Peace.